the gang, Larry Vickers, Vickers Tactical Channel, and today I'm able to introduce to you a weapon I've been wanting to for quite a while, the Vickers Elite Commander model from Wilson Combat. Now this particular one, classic commander configuration, four and a quarter inch bushing barrel, four and a quarter inch slide, standard five inch full size frame. All right, this particular one is my personal gun, all black and nine millimeter with a lightweight frame. You can also get it in 45 ACP. You can also get it special order in 38 Super. If you want a light rail frame, no problem. This particular weapon is available in steel and alloy, standard frame and rail frame. Front grasping grooves are an option. They're not standard. I configured the gun with just bold rear grasping grooves. And as you can see, the logo grips on it. If you want different front sight options, you can as well as different finish options. Any of that is customizable and you can make it to your taste at wilsoncombat.com. Now, magazines, one of the reasons why I run 9mm in it, Wilson's has largely cracked the code on the 9mm magazine. The weapon is superbly reliable because they re-engineered the 9mm magazine in 1911, which has been problematic for decades. This particular one is the Vickers Elite version magazine from Wilson Combat. One of the things we did, there's only a witness hole on both sides at the bottom when the magazine is fully loaded, no holes on the side, which stiffens it and makes it much more rigid as well as when you drop it on the ground, much less likely to gather debris. Hey, on a personal note, I want to extend a special thanks to my good friends at Wilson Combat. In my opinion, they're the number one company in the 1911 world today, and I'm very proud to be affiliated with them. We have MEN ammo on board here. We're fixing the light up. The Wilson Combat Vickers Elite Commander. Stay tuned.